So today we're on the farming series, but instead of farming, we're pretty much done. There's a little wheat to harvest. Other than that, we're done. But today's going to be building that RCC. And Bear's excited. Now let me explain this a little better. Essentially what we're doing is I'm going to start on a random lot somewhere around here. And I'm going to build out a smaller version of RCC. It can't be that big. We can't have it giant because it'll lag out the server. But we can still have, you know, maximum of 10 trucks out front. But this time... We can have people from the server come and buy trucks from us on RCC. So it'll be like a second location. Besides, this time it'll be more interactive. So there's going to be time lapses in today's video. Just a lot of building going on. Hopefully I can start developing some trucks and customizing some trucks out. But we'll see if we get to that or not. Look who it is. Right oh. on time. Whew. Sorry, I said to run all the way from uh, my house. You good, man? Want some water? I got water inside. Uh, yeah, yeah, that'd be great. That'd come be inside. Great. There you go. Even Bear sitting inside. Thank you. Whew. Just had to get my uh my daily run in, you know. Yeah. I didn't know Bear was allowed in the house. He's allowed in the house. He comes in. He's not oh. allowed to. Yeah. There he goes. He's going out. Oh, there he goes. He got him. Oh, now he's just sitting on the porch. Anyways, we got a task today. I got to transport this. Here, let me show you this. I got to transport this dozer because we're building that RCC, of course, you know. The town heard already. But yep. I got this old dozer. That'll be perfect for grading out the building lot. Oh, okay. I got... I gotta move this sucker 10 miles though. 10 miles. Yeah, yeah. How do you plan to move it? Because you don't have a low boy or anything. It goes six mile an hour. I was thinking either A, we drive it, or B, we find something to haul it with. But I don't have a low um, boy. I, you know, I don't think my trailer can handle a dozer that big. Yeah. Um, um, ho hold on, hold on. Are, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Are you thinking what I'm I mean, thinking? It's sitting on the lot. I mean, Ford Buck hasn't come and get it yet. Built tough, right? Yeah. It's a dually. Well, no time like the present. Hold on. Are the keys in it? Let's let's go check. Keys are in it. Oh well, heck yeah, y'all. You know what we're hauling this with already. Uh, I should probably call Buck first. Hold on. Let yeah, me dial you might want to give him a call. What's his phone number again? Is it? Let's see if that works. Yeah, something like that. Hey, Buck. Hello, welcome to House of China Food. What would you like to order? Eh? <laughs> I'm sorry, this is House of China Food. What would you like to order? <laughs> did, did, did you call the wrong number? It must be the wrong number. I'll hang up. Buck. Hello? Buck, how you doing, man? Pretty good right now. I'm just out at lunch. What do you need? Hey, so we you got this Platte Valley truck sitting, uh, sitting at my farm here. Could I borrow it? I just need to haul something real quick. You realize that's company property, right? Yeah, yeah. I don't think I can. Let, I, I can't let you do that, bud. Buck, it's a, uh, you know, it's, it's something real important to me, and I need to get this moved today. It's. Oh my god! Please tell it, me I didn't leave the keys in it. Keys are in it. Ah! But. All right. Well. It, it, Buck. What do you want? If it makes you feel better, it's, it's small. It's little, just a little tractor. Has a little blade I, on the front. I find out that truck gets wrecked or total, you're the one paying the ticket. Okay. The only reason is because I'm one of the higher managers up at the dealer. That's the only reason I won't get really fired. Okay. But I find out that truck gets anything done to it, you're paying the bill. It, it's, it's a Ford. Built tough, right? Yeah, it's built just tough, fine. but knowing you, it ain't going to be built tough very much longer. <laughs> Actually, no, take that back. That's Austin that's going to ruin it. Just don't let Wait. him drive it. Hey, you're on yeah. the speakerphone. Yeah. I can hear yeah. you. Yeah. yeah, I know you can Come on, buddy. Okay, he won't drive. He won't drive. I'll put him in the back. Car seat. <laughs> wait, wait. Whoa, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, put him behind the truck. It's an extended cab. Those things have no room in the back leg room for that thing. <laughs> Actually, no. Make him ride on the flatbed. Buck, I'm going to the case dealership next time. All right. Okay, yeah. Buck, so we have permission. A very minimal. Okay, permission. we'll be easy on it. Right. Okay. Real easy on it. Gotta go. But keep coming. Yep. Are we good? Keep coming. Alright. Okay, hey, 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 there you go. Good. Get, get, get. I uh, good. slid down, I, I slid the, uh, win the, I slid the window open back there so that that hitch could go through it. So, yep, it's all good. Uh, Grant, Grant, that, that's not a sliding window. That, no. That's a solid window. Oh, it, yeah, oh, uh, shoot. It'll be fine, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. Okay, watch your head back there when you sit in the back. I gotta, I gotta put you in the back. 
fuck told me. Oh, you gotta put me in the back? No, no, screw that. I'm sitting in the front. You, you know what? You know what? Fine, fine. I'll sit in the dozer. I'll sit in the dozer. You think this is gonna work, man? What if Buck sees us going down the road with it? I told him it was a small tractor. Yeah, the chances of that. He's on lunch. Buck, Buck okay. at least has a two-hour lunch. Okay. He's probably at Taco Bell. I don't know. He likes his pizza subs. Dang, she's squatting. A little bit. The exhaust is scraping on the ground. Oh, it's the, that's the uh, that's a that's a Cali lean, it's right? The thing holding up the the truck is the hitch. That's what's holding up the truck. It, it, but but it's a Cali lean, right? That's what they call it, right? Jump She's in. Tune it up. We'll be good. We just cannot. Don't let Buck see us. Don't put it on your Snapchat or anything. Uh, yeah, sure. May as well. Be safe. Oh gosh. Yeah, keep that blade up. <laughs> oh shoot. <laughs> Those mud flaps are scraping back there. <laughs> That's what they're meant to do. I wonder how many miles to the gallons you're gonna get on this. This is a lot more handier than having a trailer, though. I'll tell you what. I swear, though, if Buck sees us, we are dead. We are dead. That's when you just hit the gas. Oh shoot, Austin! Buck's calling. Buck's calling. I got it. Hold on. Be quiet. Hello. Hey, Grant. Buck, how I you gotta... doing? I'm doing pretty good. How's the uh, how's the hauling going? It's great. Oh, well, I'm thinking I might actually take off lunch a little bit early here. I got some paperwork I need to do back at the dealer. We actually have to do a, a transport of one of our little utility tractors that's possibly coming in in the next week, and I got to take that truck over to uh, over to Pella to pick up something from Vermeer, and then head down to Illinois to go pick up a uh, 1025R. You able to have that truck back? at all uh -huh. we're still using it just uh, dropping off that small tractor at my uh, grandma's here mm. all right well i guess i'll have to are you uh, leaving dealership now buck or no you have to use I'm, the restroom for five minutes no i'm, I'm already on my way back oh 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 what nothing nothing buck what what are you doing you oh, better not good. Be hey, well, we, we just good. Saw, we just saw a big deer. That's all. That's all. We just saw a big deer. We, we just oh, saw a big sure, deer. I'm sure. We just saw one. In the middle it's of the, the day. Ditch. What? Yeah. Yeah. Crazy. Where, what know, county right? road you want? I want to see what this load is. The, uh, nothing. Nothing. Not okay. nothing. Old's good. This is like one small garden truck. Old's, old's good. Old's, 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 old's good. Old's good. Old's good. That truck comes back broken. Go go go. Everything's good, Buck. Don't worry about it. Unload that sucker. We're getting this thing off. There you go. Perfect. Not even a scratch on it. Yep. No, it's all good. It's all good. Uh, Grant. Gr Grant. Yeah. The, the exhaust is kind of dragging on the ground here. Those leaf springs are broke on the left side. Ah, you won't notice. He's he going to kill notice. me. He's going to kill me. Again. He's going to kill me. He won't me. notice. He won't notice. He won't notice. But he won't notice. He, you know what? You know what? You know what? You know what you got to do? You got to buy him. A John Deere gift card. Ah, my phone's ring. Buck, hello? Hello? Yep. Hey, I'm about 10 minutes out from the dealer. I better see that truck back there in pristine condition. Well, we're about five minutes, so I probably won't see you when I'm gone, Buck. I'll probably be on the road after I drop it off, so. All right. Well, I'll make sure Tim gets me in a call if that truck's all messed up, because I know he's at the shop right now at the desk. Really? Okay. Well, we'll put... I'll keep her back there somewhere. I'll, I'll put her in there. All right. I plan to see that truck in beautiful condition when I get back. Yep. All right, I'm trusting you, bud. Don't make me have to find you. All right. Well, I'm, I'll be there in two minutes, and if that truck is busted, you're busted. Okay. I'll let you go, Buck. Just parked her. Run, run, run. Yeah. Nope. All yeah. good. Just leave. Run, man. Okay. Okay. Well, the old dozer got her done. I still think I still think the exhaust looks like a piece of wood. Does it not? But essentially, what I did is we brought in tons of fill dirt and I leveled this all out with the dozer. Uh, we got that job done. Thank you again uh, to Buck from Platte Valley for letting us use the truck to transfer this dozer. And then we have rocks through here. Now we got to put up a shop, and like I said, this RCC location isn't going to be big. One because actually only one. The main, the only reason is because I do not want to lag out these guys. If I have tons of trucks sitting here, it's going to lag out everybody, and this server is going to be absolutely screwed up. I'm going to turn on some Chris Stapleton, 
and we're going to get building this thing. Okay, so here's what I got so far. I always realize I go way too ham with the rock slash cement stuff, this stuff. It looks really good, but sometimes I do too much. So I want to put a little mulch around the edge. And then we've got these little tents. The buck made these little tents, actually, and he made them for the John Deere dealership for mowers. But I was thinking ATVs would fit perfect under that. It would be it it kind of looked like a showroom. Bushes, I kind of went ham on bushes, made like three different rows. I don't know. I thought it's just something unique. That door is tiny. And we come in here. Buck did all this for me. So thank you, Buck. You put Rolling Coal Customs. <laughs> a bucket of coal. <laughs> Rolling Coal Customs. And then let me show you guys the outside here quick. I got a duck to get underneath this thing. So RCC and then the squad established 2014. Uh, Buck kind of just edited that logo, which looks real good. And on this side, I think we have, yep, Rolling Coal Customs, bucket of coal. And I think when it gets dark, all this lights up too. I did go with the palm trees. It makes it feel like we're in Florida right now. Three palm trees. It's crazy how much it'll change the feeling of what state you're in. I probably shouldn't put those palm trees. People are gonna probably get mad at them. But we're keeping this small too. So only a couple trucks will be out here in this ditch basically. How did that just open? What the heck, dude? What just happened? Is somebody here? Nobody's here. How does that just open? Is it me or was that freaky? But anyways, inside we got trash that I placed backwards, of course, some tires. I want this to kind of look a little junky. And then we have all these different lifts here. Let's see if I can run them. So vehicle options, perfect. We can customize vehicles in here. And then I don't know exactly how to run these lifts. Oh wait, there we go, yep. So it's only this one going up and then I'll lift the vehicle up so we can have vehicles inside of here. Closed door, closed door, and then we'll close the front door here. We also have storage up here. I haven't even been in all these places. Some of these doors you can't open. So I don't know if we can open this or not. No. Yeah. Just another room. But I do need to buy some vehicles to put out front of RCC just to get some inventory in. Keep in mind, this is kind of farm country. So we're going to kind of keep it more farmer themed. Probably should get rid of those palm trees. For some reason, it makes me feel like I'm in Florida way too much. Well, we kind of got everything loaded up. Starting to get everything loaded up. Now keep in mind, there's not too many trucks I can choose from because I can't spam these guys with tons of crazy trucks. I'm only using the trucks we have available on the server. So, like I said, it's it's nothing. It's not gonna be too crazy. I kind of want to stay realistic, you know, maybe some crazy redneck lifted trucks, but nothing too insane. First to 100K, the billboard's glitching out. Should we go down the ditch? Okay, let's see what this will do. There we go. Come on. Come on. <laughs> oh, we are bottomed out. It's going. That's so good. That's so cool back there. Okay, we'll hop in the trucks. So this banana orange, like for the 06 Ford F250, F350 Super Duties, this was actually kind of a popular color. And I think, was it the Harley edition? I don't know if it, this was the Harley edition, but... I do remember orange Super Duties, or sorry, yellow Super Duties, being pretty darn pop popular, this model here. Aw, oh, I forgot to strap it down, but I forgot this one, this, this one had straps underneath. I should have strapped it down. <laughs> that looks pretty good. Dying. That looks pretty good. Okay, we'll get the green one out. Now, size comparison between the 06 F350 
And this Dodge Ram 2500 3500 is insane. This thing is tiny. There we go. Back it off. I'll put it up on the roadway. Perfect. Okay, so we're gonna take this Dodge back and grab another load. But one thing I wanna do for like the showroom or for, you know, outside is to put like tons of weight on the trailer and have it outside just in front with this Dodge and the trailer back there. We've got the old farm truck and then I got giant tracks on the back to almost act like it's using for work. Oh gosh, hopefully we can pull through here. Come on. I just gotta find a place to put it. Okay, I think for now that'll do. It gives people places to come in, come out, but once again, I want the feeling of being crammed kind of in this dealership. So we'll go back and get our uh, Dodge and then some ATVs slash side-by-sides. Okay, we got them all loaded up. Ready to rock and roll. That one even had strappable, uh, you could strap it. That was nice. What we'll do, if the Razor can fit in here, is we'll put a Razor in there. For sure the ATV, and then maybe the, uh, maybe the Honda Pioneer. There we go. Pioneer fits. Yeah, I don't know if the, is she gonna fit? Oh, it's gonna be tight. <laughs> Come on. Come on. <laughs> no, okay, we're pulling out. Nope, she's not gonna fit. We'll need this strap and then get the razor off. I gotta figure out something to put on this flatbed trailer. Well, there's RCC. Now, one thing I completely screwed up on is for some reason, I thought the sun always shined this way so that it would shine perfectly, shine perfectly on RCC, but I forgot the sun shines this way. Because then you got shadows out in front and it doesn't look that good. But it's all good. We got her done. So there's RCC. Anyways, guys, this is going to be the end of the video. Seriously, hopefully you guys did enjoy. And hey, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching, guys.